Yesterday, we told you about a trailer with $20,000 worth of equipment stolen from a Somerville storage business. After that story aired, a count on two viewer reached out to us here at News 2 and told us their trailer was also stolen from the same business on the same day. News 2's Dorchester County reporter Stetson Miller spoke to the second victim today and brings us the very latest on the investigation. After reviewing surveillance footage, Somerville police say a white pickup truck took not just one, but two trailers from this Morningstar storage unit location on Ladson Road on Friday. One of the trailers belonged to the Somerville Orchestra, and the group's equipment manager says he's surprised that this happened twice in the same place. New surveillance video images released by the Somerville Police Department today show a white pickup truck that authorities say was seen leaving a Morningstar storage location on Friday between 4 and 8 p.m. with a trailer that belonged to the Somerville Orchestra Group. Police say the truck was later seen again on the footage taking away another trailer that belonged to local contractor Glenn Powell, who we told you about yesterday on News 2. Earl Folger is the equipment manager for the orchestra group, and he said there weren't any instruments inside the trailer, but they did lose custom-made stage platforms, which he may now have to rebuild. He says he initially didn't know that the same truck was seen taking both his trailer and Powell's until police told him on Saturday. It, it's surprising to me that someone would be so bold and brazen uh, to do one theft in such a visible area and go back and do it a second time. The covered wagon trailer is 14 feet long with the orchestra group's logo on it and a unique power port on the back. There was a 12 volt power port, little black dot. It's the only trailer that's got one because I added that. It's used by the orchestra to transport equipment to different venues. And while Folger says it won't stop the group from performing, he's hoping someone saw their trailer that he says is worth about $6,000 with the equipment inside. We serve the community by performing for them. At this point, we need the community's help to find our stolen trailer. And again, if you recognize the vehicle in those images or if you have any information about the trailer thefts, you're asked to call the Somerville Police Department. In Somerville, Setson Miller, count on two.